Delays on the Frankston line made it hard for the Transport Minister to start on schedule. When things did get underway, the government confirmed plans to raise the railway at Carrum with a 900 metre long bridge and a new station. A program of works that is so much more than removal of those two dangerous congested level crossings. What we're announcing today is an opportunity to revitalise the Carrum village. Rail sidings will be moved to Cannanook, while a new road bridge will be built to take Station Street over the Patterson River. The benefits are going to be felt by thousands of local community members. But those living closest to the line are apprehensive. It'll create a lot of shadow. We don't get the you won't get the breeze coming through. It's disappointing. Very, very disappointing result for the community. It's, it's not what the community wanted. Construction of the new road bridge is due to begin next year, but the level crossing removal project itself is unlikely to be completed until early in the next decade. The government's now opted to raise the tracks at three locations along the politically sensitive line, while there'll be trenches dug at four others. Train commuters won't, won't notice the grades. Um, the train grades are, uh, are quite smooth and very flat, so it won't be a roller coaster. But no guarantee the price tag will stay below the promised $2 billion mark. We will make uh, those, uh, those figures available through the regular and normal budget reporting. Andrew Lund, Nine News.